Hey everyone, Mickey here, and welcome to episode 25 of Mario's Glory Career Mode. Uh, Preseason has begun. We are in the European International Cup tournament again. Same tournament that George Frankham just happens to be banned from for two matches. <coughs> um, in today's video, we will have. I'll show you all the preseason. Oh, actually, there will just be match recaps because of all the preseason games. These first three are, of course, um, the group stages. So depending on how we go on this, we'll determine whether or not we make it to the semis and so forth. So I'll just play all three of those cup games. You will just get the match recaps, like I said. And then after that, depending on how far we get, we will do the last game, which should be a full... Well, you'll see You'll see the last game if we win or lose. That, depending, that is dependent on whether we win or lose. We have not brought in anyone. <coughs> Uh, apart from McGowan, who came from Adelaide, uh, pretty much because Carly Osborne has gone because uh, he was on loan, so he's returned to his club. Um, and I th so McGowan, we needed a fourth centre back. And do, 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 do. transfer negotiations. We've sent off a transfer offer for Pass um, Passlack from. Borussia Dortmund. You can play right back, right mid, centre back if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going to use him as a right mid. Um, if I don't get him, then I'll pick up. Or then, if I don't get him, then I'm going to aim for Alex Kawamie. Where is he? Oh, come on. So, so far down the list. This guy right here. It was a choice between him or Lundy. The Kuomye has more stamina, his stats are a lot more balanced I guess. Though in saying that, Brandon Lundy does have crossing, I could always work on his stamina. So yeah, it'd be one of those two guys. And it won't take long to get him up 6 points in overall anyways. Just use him in uh, what's called squad training. So I'm going to go ahead and play this game against Clermont Foot. I'm pretty sure it's pronounced Foot. Um, they are French League 2. Club, if I'm not mistaken, uh, the European International Tournament will offer me 1.5 mil if I win it. So, gonna go ahead and play this game. I'll be back at the end of it. I'll, I'll be back at. The, I'll be back after the match recap. So fucking frustrating. They scored within the first three minutes, and then after that, they literally just parked the bus. So fucking annoying. Not just that, we had one good attempt, but Bartram got in the way of fucking Taylor. Good work, Bartram, you fucking idiot. <coughs> so, our first loss in the preseason cup. Uh, hopefully, we could bounce back in the next one. But I had so many chances, and oh my gosh. You know, that's it. That's all you get to watch of that match. Okay, fuck them. I'm gonna go ahead and do squad rotation, be back at the start of the next game. Uh, so, we take on Vbog. Again, you will get another, <laughs> another um, match recap. Uh, we weren't able to get, where are we, pass luck because they wanted a mil for him, or well, 980,000, which I don't have, <clears throat> I'll probably get after this. So I put in a transfer offer, well, transfer offer for Alex Kawamie, who was going for 140k, and also for Tyler Walker, who's going for 325,000, mainly because we will need a new, another striker to add to the mix. Uh, <coughs> because I can fend was on his what? We've got 12 months left. Let's take a look. less than a year. All these players. I will re uh, uh, resign Nightingale. We'll take a look after. So we take on the Borg. So I'll be at the. I'll be back after the match recap. So we lost again. Had, again, had another good opportunity. But instead of putting it in the back of the net, Kaja decided to tap it with the side of his foot and fuck all happened with it. That's literally what happened. It should have it in the match recap here. McDonald played a good game. So I'm not going to be annoyed at the fact that I chose to put him on the not in between the posts today. He did his job. Here's the goal right here. Ah, oh, a load of bullshit. But fuck you, he's not going to watch the rest of the match recap. 
So gonna go ahead, do squad rotation. We'll be back at the end of the next game. Or before the next game, depending on whether or not the transfers go through. Transfer offers are coming. <clears throat> I've rejected both of them for Akinfenero and Fitzpatrick. Nottingham Forest are happy with it, so we're gonna go ahead and sort out his contract. D -d 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 sporadic return him into squad rotation player, see what it says about that. And then they want 210 for Alex Kawamie. That's not too bad, it's only 70k more. So hopefully we'll see what comes of that. <clears throat> and we'll sort out the contracts for Akin Fenwa, though, <clears throat> as he uh, does need to re-sign. And I will go ahead and re-sign all those who have short contracts, not a year left on their contract. So, oh wait. <clears throat> du -du 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 -du. Donald can play the last game of this, and Burn can come off for... Wait, we've got Tungo on. Wait, how come... How come Harrison hasn't... So we take on Cambridge United in the last game of this tournament. We sit at the bottom, so even if we win, we're not going to qualify. Clermont Fruit and Cambridge have already sealed the thing. But you know what we can do? We can at least come away with a win. So I come away. Go, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and play this game. We'll be back at the end of it. So as you saw. Should Cambridge United? Why? <laughs> Why we got promoted from League Two into League One? Christian Tunga, as you just saw that right then, brilliant goal. He ran in, picked up the scraps from Frank Holmes, free kick. And I'm not gonna lie, we were just playing brilliantly in this game. George Frank on picking up a yellow card for some stupid challenge. It wasn't even really that much of a challenge. There's nothing in it. Ref is blind. But he was the difference maker, having him on the field, his runs. Bartram just... I guess Bartram isn't as good as he is on the right. That's the reason why Kawamio is on... Well, bought Kiw, oh, buying Kawamio. There's see Frank on getting a yellow card, getting a... Oh, was it... Would you cast it as this name? Getting a yellow card, getting a goal. And, a, and Christian Tunga. Once again, that's his second goal of the game. I tried, I was hoping he would get his hat trick. Wasn't able to. But we were just lucky that we were all over Cambridge United. So our tournament is done. That was the last goal, his second goal. Yep. Man of the match. Man of the match. So I'm going to go ahead, do squad rotation. We'll be back at the start of the next game. Though I'm pretty sure the next game is a Capital One Cup game. So we might just get another match recap. Uh, so. We got our players, Tyler Walker, signed on the dotted line. Four years, 2,250. Uh, important team player. And so did Alex Kawamia, same deal, four years, 2,250. So that's two new people, or two new players that we have, a new right mid, a new striker, mainly because uh, Akin Fenwell will most likely retire. About the new contract. Uh, that's because I gave him the wrong amount of time. So yeah, so hopefully they will be here for a while, so let's see if we can do it with these squad, uh, pill bean, that's because I gave the wrong the contracts, pill bean people, uh, where are we, bam, refused contract, three years, one, one, two, three, and important, squad rotation player, yeah, pill bean. Ah. Yeah, 
yeah, they have to go through and do Gallagher accepted, Akaferno accepted, Robinson accepted, and then who are these guys? So yeah, so we're going to continue to go ahead, sim through, and we'll be back at the start of the next game. Like the start of the first game for the season, I should say. So, for, so we come to our first game of the season, of the regular season, against Shrewsbury. Pretty sure we put into this hole previously, so let's get into it. Kenneth McAvoy, I see you on the left. Oh, ref! Ref! Oh my gosh. Oh, look at this, I can fend go. Tyler Walker getting on the board. Ah, oh, he was, um, what was it? In training, showing promise. Player showing promise. Bam! Finesse shot. His first goal for the season. On his debut. We go up 1 0. So we go into the second half, leading 1 0. Tyler Walker, the only player to get onto the board thus far. Beautiful play. Tyler Walker. Go. Ah, oh, ref. Come on, Bartram. Playing on the left now. Playing on your favourite side. There we go. Look at that. Go on a mad dash. Go on a mad dash. Go on a mad dash. Fitzpatrick. Tyler Walker. Oh, Taylor Lyle Taylor, what? Oh, what? He was offside. That was not offside. <sighs> Fitzpatrick holding his ha head in his hands. He wasn't sure how that did not go in. <sighs> go, Bartram. Go Bartram. Go Bartram. He's onside. Taylor is onside. And Taylor scores a goal. Oh, I was just waiting for that whistle to blow. Even though I knew he was onside. Boom. First goal for the season. According to the stats, our predicted finish is going to be 20 seconds. I don't think so. Lyle Taylor. Tyler, Tyler Walker. <clears throat> going to be the difference makers this season. Go forward. Go forward, guys. Go forward. Oh, my gosh. And that's all she wrote. Uh, if you enjoy, wait, we'll see who man of the match is first. Man of the match, man of the match, pill beam. Hmm. Well, if you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. It will be greatly appreciated. Don't forget to subscribe and share. That will also be greatly appreciated. Follow me on Twitter. Follow the Dan and Mickey Show on Facebook, Twitter, and all that jazz. Links in the description below. And I'll see you guys next time.